and getting an email that says you can get money if you put in some personal information should raise red flags. And some of you may have gotten one recently claiming to be the result of a big privacy lawsuit with Facebook. But is it real? Casey Decker verifies. When class action lawsuits reach a settlement, a notice goes out to everyone who could claim a portion of the money. But when those notices suddenly appear in your inbox seeming to offer free money, it's natural to be suspicious. A Verify viewer recently got such an email saying he could get cash from a settlement with Facebook and he wanted to know if it's real. So let's verify. Is this Facebook internet tracking settlement legit? Our sources, court documents from the Northern District of California and David Strait, one of the lead lawyers in the suit. The notice our viewer got included a link to a website called FBInternetTrackingSettlement.com. That may seem like a suspicious site at first, but it is in fact pretty common for pages like this to be set up for class action lawsuits. The site also lists a specific case number for the settlement, so we looked up the court records. And documents from the U.S. District Court in Northern California match the documents listed on the website. The docs also specifically list the website's URL as the platform that people should visit to file their claim or object to the terms of the settlement. We also reached out to the legal team that brought the suit, and one of the lead attorneys said, quote, yes, the website is legitimate, and we encourage all class members to consider filing a claim. So we can verify, yes, this Facebook internet tracking settlement and its website are legit. The suit alleges Facebook improperly tracked people's data, specifically U.S. Facebook users who went to websites that displayed Facebook like buttons in a certain period between 2010 and 2011. If you fit that bill, you can go to the site and file a claim, and you could eventually get your cut of the $90 million deal. Facebook did not admit to wrongdoing in the settlement and did not respond to our request for comment. With your Verify, I'm Casey Decker. Now, if you have something you want us to verify, send us a message to our email, verify at 12newsnow.com or hit us up on one of our social media accounts.